Debris Hayamin Bet chapter 15. And the spirit of Elohim came upon Azariahu, son of Oded, and he went out to face Asa and said to him, Hear me, Asa, and all Yehuda and Benjamin, Yah is with you while you are with him. And if you seek him, he is found by you. But if you forsake him, he forsakes you. And for many days Israel has been without the true Elohim and without a Torah priest and without Torah. But in their distress, they turned to Yah, Elohim of Israel, and they saw him and he was found by them. And in those days, there was no peace to the one who went out, nor to the one who came in. For great disturbances were on all the inhabitants of the lands. And they were beaten down nation by nation and city by city. For Elohim troubled them with every distress. But you be strong and do not let your hands be feeble. For there is a reward for your work. And when Asa heard these words in the prophecy of Oded the prophet, he strengthened himself and removed the abominations from all the land of Yehuda and Benjamin and from the cities which he had taken in the mountains of Ephraim and restored the slaughter place of Yah that was before the porch of Yah and gathered all Yehuda and Benjamin and those who sojourned with them from Ephraim to Manasseh and Shimon. For they came over to him in great numbers from Israel when they saw that Yah his Elohim was with him. And they gathered together at Yerushalayim in the third new moon in the fifteenth year of the reign of Asa and slaughtered to Yah on that day seven hundred bulls and seven thousand sheep from the spoil which they had brought. And they entered into a covenant to seek Yah Elohim of their fathers with all their heart and with all their being. And whoever would not seek Yah Elohim of Israel would be put to death from small to great, from man to woman. And they swore to Yah with a loud voice, with shouting, and with trumpets, and with shofarot. And all Yehuda rejoiced concerning the oath, for they had sworn with all their heart, and saw him with all their being. And he was found by them, and Yah gave them rest all around. And he also removed Ma'akah, the mother of Asa the sovereign, from being sovereignist mother, because she had made an abominable image of Asherah. And Asa cut down her abominable image and crushed it and burned it by the Wadi Kidron. Yet the high places were not removed from Israel. However, the heart of Asa was perfect all his days. And he brought into the house of Elohim the set-apart items of his father and his own set-apart items, silver and gold and utensils. And there were no more fighting until the 35th year of the reign of Asa.